up everyone? Nerdy Noob here and welcome back to another unboxing video. In this video, we're going to be unboxing the 2018 August. I don't know what this box is called anymore. This is the Geek Gear Wizardry box. It used to be called World of Wizardry. Yeah. World of Wizardry box. I don't know if it's still called that or not, but this is the Harry Potter slash Fantastic Beast theme box from Geek Gear. This box has been pretty good. It's I don't have too many Harry Potter boxes on my channel, but this is probably the best one that I have on my channel. It gives us a mixture of license items and Etsy type items, and so far it's just been, you know, it's been consistently just, I like it. I like it a lot. I like it better than the Loot Crate, uh, what is that one called, Wizarding World box? So if I had to recommend, well I don't know, I, I guess I should see what this one looks like, but just based off my past experience. Anyways, if you're interested in getting this box, I will go ahead and put all of the pricing details in the description below for you. Once you pull the tab, that was a good one, and you open up the box and you remove the tissue paper. I see green tissue paper, which means if we got a themed box, because I, I kind of have the mixture box, so it's just whatever, uh, we got Slytherin, which is cool. We haven't received Slytherin in a long time. Um, I did want to point out, I think I point this out in my vlog, that the box is green. It usually is red, unless they give us the color of the box based off the house theme. I actually didn't even think about that. I don't know, because it's been red for me for a while. All right, let's check it out the first item we have oh this is really cool it's a it's a bracelet it's almost like what a friendship bracelet looks like but there's beads on it that spell out slytherin this is a licensed product i like this so yeah our our theme box is slytherin i wonder if you got a yellow box if you got hufflepuff or a blue box if you got a ravenclaw or the red box if you got gryffindor i'm not quite sure but this is really cool there's a couple it's like a little yarn bracelet with the plastic beads and then there's actually like a little uh, Slytherin charm bead, which is very nice as well. That's cool. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. All right, the next item we got is a pin. It came in this box. That's what the pin looks like. Let's go ahead. I'll open up the box and we can take the pin out. It's a pretty big pin. They actually have some really cool pins. I'm not going to lie. So this is a, what do they call it? It was just an enamel pin. This is basically... I think this, I would say Slytherin theme because of the scarf color, and it just has a bunch of the different, whoa, 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 it has a bunch of the different textbooks, so you have magical creatures, locations and habitats, charms, defense, and potions. So there you go. Double backing pin, very cool. Next, we got a pair of socks. Um, oh, these are actually, because they're made by Geek Gear, but every time we ever get like homemade socks from people, they're a little bit not sketchy, just not like the greatest, but these actually feel very thick, which is very nice. So these are crew socks. Now these are red, these are very, very, well, I'm impressed for them making in-house socks for how thick and squishy these are, because usually we get these cheap type socks. This, these pairs of socks have different symbols that represent Harry Potter, so you have Hedwig's cage, you have the lightning bolt, you have his glasses, you have, what else do you have? I'm trying to, I'm trying to see it. Oh, I think you have the Patronus sign, the stag, and then you have some wands, and then I don't know what that little circle thing's supposed to be, but these are red socks with kind of yellow and white. I'm I am very impressed though on these socks. Are these over the calf socks? They actually do look. I'm gonna open these. They look pretty long. <gasps> yes. Are these tube socks? Yes. Yes. I love. <clears throat> over the calf socks is what I call them, but they're also known as tube socks. And they're basically not crew, they're longer than crew socks. They usually go up to your knee. I like to play, I play softball, as you guys may or may not know, and I like wearing long socks when I play softball. And so these are gonna be really cool to wear. Oh, I'm excited to open those. I was wondering why they felt so like big. Okay, we have two shirts in the box. We'll save those for last. This again was for 2018 August. Let's see, we have a couple of recipe cards. Let's check out what we got. We got Sherbet, got Sherbet, Lemons, sherbet, no, sorbet, no, I don't know. These are little candy, lemon candies. Lenny, lemon candies? I don't know if they're hard candies or if they're supposed to be squishy. They're sugar coated. Usually you sugar coat things that are squishy. Actually, I don't really know though because based off of the, uh, based off of the ingredients, it just looks like a sugar candy. And then we got petunias pudding. I'm not gonna lie, that looks like something from Hook. You know, like when they have the food fight? <laughs> okay, the last item before the shirt is our licensed print. <clears throat> we got 
It's a chocolate frogs, uh, kind of like an ad, like a fake ad from Honey Dukes. So that's pretty cool. I like that. Nice. Okay, now onto our shirt. So we got two shirts. We got a black shirt and a gray shirt. Let's go ahead and do the gray shirt first. We have a Guild and Soft Style Men's Medium. It's kind of a, it's a gray, but it's kind of like a little bit of a heathered gray. Now that I like know that term, I use it all the time, I must say. Oh, I like the feel of this shirt though. It's soft and it's not super thick, <clears throat> which I prefer. They're just more comfortable. Okay. So, <clears throat> when I first had seen the clue from last one's box, I, th I think I had said that these were, I don't know, the three, these are, so these are the three brothers. I thought that they represent death, but I, I think I'm wrong about that. Um, I actually really like this shirt though. God, I obviously need to, I need to uh, catch up on my, my Harry Potter. I just, I honestly, just haven't, I need to reread the books. I think is what I want to do. I think I want to reread the books because those are absolutely my favorite books. And obviously, I also think like I've watched and watched movies and read books now being an adult. And I pick up on things that I didn't necessarily pick up on when I was younger reading these books. And I haven't read these books since I was like in high school. So it's been a while. Anyways, our last shirt is a Guild and Soft Style Men's Medium. It's a black shirt. Here's the design. It says magic and spells. Wizard, witches, wands, potions. This looks like it's part of like, like a cool little group. I actually like this design too. I would wear that. Okay, that's all the items in the box. Let's go ahead and do our present and recap. Uh, next month's box hint is design a wand competition winner. Oh, so they must have had somebody design a wand and then that winner is gonna win something. All right. Oh, darn. Okay, wow, that's interesting. So, first of all, let's just go through. They did have, uh, the pin was the same, but if you, depending on what house you got, you got different colors that represent that house. So we got the Slytherin pin. I'm gonna go ahead and give that pin $6 because it's big. It's not licensed, but it's big and it's, it's nice. Now the bracelets are different. There was like a bunch, you could have either gotten the bracelet I got, which is the top row, or you can got, you could have gotten like a, a, like almost like a, what is it called? A, is it a low-key bracelet? The ones that have the like silicone? That one has, it looks like a bracelet set to be honest. Oh, it's, oh, that was a special thing. So 500 lucky people receive a lovely four bracelet set. Um, and that one came with a bunch of different types of bracelets. Okay, so we were not one of the lucky 500, but that's okay. Cause I actually really like the bracelet we got. But if you won the, the set of four, that probably was really cool too. So this bracelet's actually really cool. Again, it is licensed, it's a BioWorld product. I would say that this bracelet, you could easily give this anywhere from six to eight dollars. I think eight dollars is high, but I, I can imagine like at Hot Topic that they probably would charge you eight dollars for. I'm gonna go ahead and give it seven. We'll say six ninety nine. That might be a little bit high. I'm not quite sure. We had our two shirts. We had our magic and spell shirt, and then we had our three brothers shirt. Yeah, the three brothers. I guess they didn't represent death. I can't remember to be honest. I'm gonna give each of those shirts ten dollars. So that's twenty dollars for the two. We had our licensed chocolate frog prints. I'm gonna go ahead and give that uh, five dollars. But there's actually different ones that you could receive. Oh, I like the Quidditch World Cup. And then there was also there's so there's four total different ones. I really like that blue one in the middle, top middle, the Quidditch World Cup one. But we got the chocolate frogs. But that's still cool. And then the last one we got is our um, recipe cards. I'm gonna go ahead and give that. I don't know. I don't think we usually, 50 cents. A dollar? 50 cents. We'll give it 50 cents. Okay, so according to my pricing, this box is, oh, I didn't do the socks. I didn't do the socks, sorry. Uh, we got our high knees, our knee high socks, which I'm very, very excited about. Um, I usually give regular crew socks $5. I think that these are not licensed, but I think that you could give, because in-house socks I usually give $4, and I think you could probably give, so I probably, probably seven to $8 for these, I think. Let's do seven fifty. I really like, knee high socks, like they're my favorite. I'm very excited. And these ones are like, they just feel so squishy and comfortable. Okay, so according to my pricing, this box is worth $46. We paid $34 a month, which means we got $12 extra value. And for a $34 box, that's basically what we're kind of looking for about what, $11 extra value, so we got $12 extra value. This box has been killing it. This company in general, the Geek Gear and the, the Wizarding Box have been killing it with the value. And I actually really enjoyed this month's 
um, items. Sometimes they uh, focus a little bit more on like the Etsy type items. Sometimes it's a little bit more licensee. Um, this was a good mixture for me personally, and I actually like. I really I like the shirt design specifically. I like the gray shirt design better than I like the red shirt design. The red one's a little bit. This one's a little bit like biker gang type style for me. So it's a little a little bit not as much my style. I actually like this print. I think I would have preferred the Quidditch World Cup one better, but, and then the bracelet's really cool and I like the socks. And then the pins are cool. So yeah, I like this box. If I had to rate this box, I would probably give this box, I would say, my mind's telling me a four out of five noobs. I actually like this box. It's not my favorite box that I've ever received from them, but I like it a lot, it has good value. I think maybe a 4.25 is a little bit more of a realistic, um, value. If you liked everything in the box, you could easily give this box a five though because it did hit the extra value that we're looking for. And you know, it. I think there's a lot of people out there who like when we get two shirts. I'm not as much of a fan of it, but um, I know that there's a lot of people who do enjoy that. I just get a lot of shirts as you guys know. All right, guys, that is all I have for you in this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, feel free to click the like button below. If you want to see more unboxing videos, go ahead and check out my channel. I have a whole bunch on there, and you should subscribe. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys thought about this box. What are your thoughts about the items? What are your thoughts about the value? And just did you like the mixture of items? What would you rate the box? Let me know all of your thoughts down below. And before we go, we must do the video shout out. I actually don't have my phone up here and I'm too lazy to go downstairs and get it. So I'm gonna give the video shout out to somebody off the top of my head and I'm gonna give it to Bunny. Bunny, you're getting the video shout out. Thank you so much for watching, commenting, and supporting my channel. I can't remember if I have given you the video shout out like recently, but you have been commenting recently and I just, I know off the top of my head that I've really enjoyed your comments. So, I, Bunny, you've been here for a long time. I just want to say thank you for all of your support. Thank you for your continued support. And thank you for taking the time, even with how long you've supported me, to take the time to write the comments that you write. I do appreciate it greatly. And I want to make sure that I show you that I appreciate you. So I want to give you the video shout out. You ready for it? Shout out to you, Bunny. Shout out to you. All right, guys. I hope you have an amazing day, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.